The Oregon Health Authority is changing its requirements now for COVID-19 testing. That could mean many more people could get tested for the disease. Fox 12's Drew Reeves is live with who this will affect. Drew? Yeah, last night the OHA said it was reviewing its guidelines and made some changes that will help uh, impacted populations and frontline workers. It could also mean that some people who show no symptoms could get a test. We've heard many stories of people looking for COVID-19 tests, but unsuccessfully meeting the testing criteria. But today, the Oregon Health Authority has announced some big changes. These new guidelines urge clinics to increase testing if they can for specific groups that are at risk for getting COVID-19. That includes people who work in group living or care facilities, marginalized populations, including racial minorities, and essential frontline workers. The new guidelines say people showing symptoms who belong to these groups should be tested for the flu, then COVID-19. The decision is being applauded by some who have been pushing for testing for specific groups. The ACLU of Oregon says Oregon has been doing a good job of tracking the effects of this disease on race. COVID-19 is not an equal opportunity disease, so we must address the pandemic through a racial justice lens. Oregon Health Authority says COVID-19 disproportionately affects people from racial minorities. Existing disparities in health care, the criminal justice system, and the workforce, among other areas, make Black people, Latinx people, and Indigenous, indigenous people among the most vulnerable communities at risk during the COVID-19 pandemic. The decision to change guidelines is also being welcomed by the local chapter of the United Food and Commercial Workers Union. In a statement, the group's president said grocery workers and healthcare professionals are standing face to face with the pandemic and they should be prioritized for testing and that testing will undoubtedly benefit the public. These guidelines are quite different from previous guidelines, which said only specific people with specific symptoms should get tested. In addition, the OHA also suggests that people who aren't showing symptoms but work in group living systems can be tested if supplies allow. The new guidelines also state that clinicians can order COVID-19 tests at their discretion from clinical labs and do not have to report to OHA when they order these tests. And the Oregon Health Authority says, still says that if you do not need a medical emergency, you should stay home and then call your physician to see if you should come in to be seen. Reporting live in Beaverton, Drew Reeves, Fox 12 Oregon.